This piece, uh, the Piano Concerto by Arnold Schoenberg, he wrote during the Second World War. He was already in America, and um, he took a very nostalgic tone row. It was after he invented the, the 12 tone system around 1922, around there, 21, 22, and then he was writing very, uh, working very hard at, at a new way of composing. And so the, the piece um, is based on 12 notes of a, in a specific order which is, can be transposed. And, and this tone row, you can do all sorts of things, even this is a tone row, yeah? But this one is like this. And the inversion that is, if you put inversion, is the re uh, reverse. If you put the mirror underneath, and, the, the, and what shows on the mirror that you write uh, this on, on, the, on, on, on a piece of paper and put the mirror, what shows the re inversion of this is... You can hear the, 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 that is already very ha friendly, no? The last note that whoops, it's like C major chord. So he uh, and he uses it very in a, in a way, and they, uh, they start with. Uh, on the, So, if you listen to this, it is actually unbelievably friendly. So, bear that in mind and don't be scared, don't run away and just keep your ears open. Of course, there are much harder things to come. But I think he really wrote it with the nostalgia of a man who had to, uh, well, who left his, his uh, homeland, which, uh, he, was a, he was born in Vienna, he was a Viennese. And, and not only, but also possibly, it is what I think, he might have been nostalgic for the diatonic tonal world or atonality before the 12th tone, because that is a rigid system. And so he is nostalgic about various things. So, and, and I have therefore a, a great love for this piece.